Corvo DecaWave's previous ultra wideband module, the DWM1000, was released back in 2014 and was renowned for allowing real time location tracking with extreme precision. Seven years later, Corvo DecaWave has now released the new upgrade to that module, the DWM3000. Today at Symmetry, we'll be unboxing the DWS3000 Arduino Shield. Every DWS3000 shield has a DWM3000 module mounted onto it. The DWM3000 from Corvo DecaWave is based on Corvo's ultra-wideband compliant wireless transceiver the DW3110IC. With speeds 50 times faster than GPS technology and with more accuracy, this allows for real-time location of objects with a precision of up to 10 centimeters. The DWM3000 module supports data rates of 850 kilobits per second and 6.8 megabits per second and has worldwide ultra-wideband support with channel 5 and channel 9. The newly added channels allow the DW3000 series to meet certification in many new countries worldwide that weren't possible with the previous DW1000 product line. The addition of Channel 9 especially opens the door for ultra-wideband opportunities across the globe. The module simplifies design integration with the inclusion of the DW3110IC a ceramic ultra-wideband antenna, efficient power management, and an optimum RF layout. The full RF design has been validated and tested, so no RF design is required on your part. The DWM3000 module is pin and size compatible with the previous DWM1000, as both are 23 by 13 by 2.9 millimeters and have 24 pins with a 1.4 millimeter pitch side castellation. Compared to its predecessor, the 3000 series has improved power consumption along with the newly added channel nine support. The DW3000 series also adds additional cryptography for enhanced security. All the modules and pins are easily accessible, and the DWS3000 includes an onboard 3.3 volt DC to DC converter. The lower power consumption of this module allows it to be powered by batteries for long periods of time, and thus allows your ultra wideband solution to be implemented with more cost efficiency. So as we said earlier, every DWM3000 module is mounted onto an Arduino form factor compatible shield, thus expanding the connections to the device. You can simply plug and play on a dev board without the need to solder anything and can start testing right away. The DWS3000 has the DW3000 transceiver but it will still need the brain to drive it. Unlike the DW1000, which came with its own Nordic SOC, the DWS3000 does not come with one. In other words, you will need an MCU of some sort to pair with each DWS3000 board in order to do anything. The good news is that the DWS3000 grants you the option of using this module with any MCU of your choice. At Symmetry, we highly recommend using the Nordic NRF52840 development kit. This is the updated variant for the Nordic SOC that was the standard on most BLE designs for the past five years, and also has the most resources available online, including the Seger Embedded Studio project, especially made for the Nordic NRF52840 development board. Full schematics for this are available in PDF format by Corvo DecaWave, and you can find those at our website. The link is in the description below. 
And that will do it for this unboxing. Thanks for joining us today and be sure to subscribe and remember that our engineers offer support for your design anytime. So contact Symmetry today.